Hey, 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 hi everybody. I hope you're all having a good day. I hope you're all smiling and enjoying your lovely day. So in this following tutorial, I'm going to be teaching you on how to set up uh, YouTube in Vinyan by using a program called StreamerBot. Um, now, in case you don't know, uh, Vinyan natively supports Twitch. Um, and it does not have native support for YouTube, uh, mainly because YouTube API sucks. But don't worry, there is actually a way of doing that with StreamerBot, and I will show you how to do it, and I'll try to explain it as easy as possible. So let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to set up a node graph. Um, so basically, you're going to go into Add New Graph, and then you're going to go down to Callback Nodes. You're going to scroll all the way down to Other Callbacks and set up a WebSocket here. Then, um, pretty much after the WebSocket command, you're basically going to set up whichever sort of command you want to set up for your chat. So if you want your chat to feed your avatar with a command, they can, you can choose, you know, a food command. Or maybe you want some confetti. Or maybe you want people to yeet your character. So let's say we want to do that. We want to have it have a yeet command so we can yeet our avatar, you know, our chat can yeet our avatar basically. So set up the values um, however you want, experiment, and pretty much um, you're going to name it however you want basically. Do keep in mind that for the WebSocket command, this is not going to be the command that your chat is going to type out. This is just going to be the command that StreamerBot is going to be reading. So do keep in mind of the difference. I will explain um, actually right now, uh, well in a little bit because we gotta set up StreamerBot. So you're going to have to make sure to download the program StreamerBot. Um, and again, I do apologize if I'm going too fast. I'm trying to make sure this tutorial isn't too long. Um, but basically you're going to have to make sure to install StreamerBot as well as making sure Vinyan is installed of course. And basically what you're going to do is you're going to go into servers and clients. You're going to go into the WebSocket clients. Do not worry about any other tab. Focus on the tab that I'm explaining. And basically you're going to right click and click on add. Then what you're going to do is you're going to set the name to be Vinyan. You're going to set the endpoint. Change this number to be 8000 and then add Vinyan in lowercase at the ending here. Then select auto connect on startup and then reconnect on disconnect and then click on OK. For my case, I already have mine. Um, when you do add yours, you're going to have to make sure to right click and click on connect. For mine, it says disconnect, but for yours, it will say connect. So please make sure that the status is set to open. That way StreamerBot and Vinyan are communicating. Once you have that, then you're going to go into platforms and you're going to make sure to log in with your account basically. If you want to set up StreamerBot with Twitch and do some stuff, you may, but it is unnecessary as Vinyan already has Twitch support. For YouTube, you are going to sign in with your Google account, sign in, choose your um, YouTube channel, and you should be able to be connected. Once you have that, the next step we're going to go to is we're going to go into actions right here. So basically, um, for actions, you're going to right click and click on add. This is going to basically be the WebSocket name that you set up here. So whatever you name the WebSocket here, you're going to copy and paste it over here, basically. So we're going to call this Yeet2, but as you can see in my other ones, I named mine Dropbox or Feed or Giant Kana or Glitch. You can name it however you want, just to show you other examples. Um, but basically you're going to go over here, you're going to right click on sub actions, you're going to go into core, then C sharp, then execute C sharp code, and in the description you're going to copy the code that's in the description and you're going to paste it here basically. For mine, because I don't really have it in memory, I'm going to go ahead and just steal it from this one over here. So real quick, core, C sharp, execute, and then I'm just going to select everything and then just paste it. Just like that. And pretty much in case you're wondering, it's line 7 that basically has is doing most of the work basically. So right here on line 7, you're going to basically change this to whatever your WebSocket name is basically. So I'm going to name mine to Yeet2. So keep that in mind that um, change it accordingly depending on how many commands you're having. So make sure every action has their own name. Otherwise they're going to clash and it's going to get confusing. So once you have that, uh, then you're going to go into commands and then you're going to right click and click on add. 
then you're going to type out the command that you want your chat to do. So it could be exclamation mark yeet. For mine, I'm going to put in two, but it could be whatever you want. Exclamation mark, whatever the heck the command is. Once you have that, then you're going to set your action to be whichever action you made for the dedicated WebSocket in Binyan to trigger said action. So this will be yeet2, select. Then you're going to change the source from Twitch message to YouTube, unless you want it for both, but honestly just keep it on YouTube message. Vinyan has native um, commands for Twitch, again, Twitch support is native in Vinyan, so yeah. And pretty much, once you have the action, the source, and the command here is set up, you're pretty much good to go. You don't have to set up this, you don't have to set up cooldown, unless you want to, but otherwise, you know, do your edits if you wish, but otherwise this is pretty much mainly what you have to do. And that's pretty much it. Um, that's pretty much how you will set up a YouTube command. That way, uh, your chat can actually interact with your avatar on YouTube streams. And, you know, you can go crazy, have as many as you want, like how I have a lot. And also, just to uh, say this as well real quickly, so on YouTube, uh, do keep in mind there are some limitations with the API, but you could set up events like membership or, you know, super chat events, which are really fun. So definitely um, mess around with that. And that's pretty much it regarding how to set up YouTube with Binyan. I hope that this tutorial helps you out and let me know if you have any other questions. I'll leave my socials here, um, but otherwise I do recommend joining Superdrill's Discord server if you need any more assistance with Binyan. And that's all I have to say. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye!